It is Monday morning and it is a bank holiday here, so I think it's gonna be, um, I expect it to be very, very busy no matter where we go, because everybody will be off. Um, and in the United States, it's Memorial Day, so happy Memorial Day to everybody. Um, right now we are going to Trafalgar Square. We're gonna see if the lions are open because we haven't been probably four days, Kevin. It, it's been it's been days and they had them blocked off because they were cleaning them so we're gonna go back and and see if they're they've opened them back up now hopefully i hope they have <laughs> um so and then but the plan is we're going to buckingham palace to the queen's gallery uh, we did not do that last year so we're gonna do that and it, it um Hopefully it'll be open. As far as what Kevin can tell online, it, they are supposed to be open today. So I don't think that'll be a problem. So anyway, I will, uh, I'll see you at, uh, at uh, Trafalgar Square because I'm not gonna film this going against, uh, across the bridge. I've, I think I've done that every single day. So. so yesterday when we were on the bus tour, our tour guide said that they were doing some kind of a run today. And so she said that, um, she said you don't want to get anywhere near London or the major attractions today because you're not going to be able to see anything um, because their tra traffic will be so bad because they have everything blocked off. And Kevin just remembered that. And you can see there is no traffic coming down this road. And normally it's like, <clears throat> normally it's bumper to bumper just like it is all over the place here. But it's also blocked off over there where they're going to be doing the run. I don't know what it's a run for, but they um, they have runs all the time at home too, so I know what it's like. So that's why we're not, that's why it's so quiet. I mean, think about how used to that traffic we've gotten and how you don't hear anything. Isn't that amazing? Yeah. All the buses are lined up because they're not going anywhere. That is just amazing. I didn't even think about the not hearing the noise of the traffic. Hey, what? There's no one in these souvenir shops if you wanted to have the run of the place. Oh, yeah. Yeah, this will be the easiest day we've had of crossing well, over. Good. But they're not blocked off. Huh? Yeah, I know. Uh, I want you all to know that I was going to climb up here. I was going to get on top of one, but I thought there were steps to get you from here to there. There are no steps anywhere around this monument. So first you have to get all the way up, which sounds like it would be really easy, but it's not. I mean, it's high. You can see how, how tall it is. Yeah, I mean, you have to be, look, he's young, and he's he's trying to get up there. Yeah, see how he's having to climb and roll on his belly? I'm in a dress shirt, so I'm not going to do that. Yeah, I'm not doing that. Yeah, they're actually having to use their bellies to do it. So, as much as I would have loved to have sat on top of one of those, it's just not happening. So, Kevin took my picture. So for anyone who lives in this area and doesn't know, if you want pictures without any traffic or you want to come on a day where you don't have to worry about traffic, this is the day. Now, if you buy a hop on hop off tour, today would not be the day. Yeah, it would be a bad day because you would have wasted your, your money and it's expensive. Look at this monument. I saw this a few days ago, and you're fine. I saw this a few days ago, and I didn't know what it was. It's quite the monument. 
So these are all the uh, the runners. They hadn't started yet. So maybe they don't start until 10. It's only 9.30 right now. So they said there's 12,500. 12. 12,500 people that signed up for this race. So we're walking by right now. It doesn't start for another half hour. So Kevin and I aren't going to stand here and wait for them to take off. But if I had somebody in it, I would definitely watch. But it's it just keeps going back further and further and further with people waiting. I'm just thinking they're standing there all that time waiting for it to start. I wanted to tell you all because I'll forget. We came up into Waterloo Station the other day and there was a guy standing there and you're used to seeing the dogs on a leash. He had a cat, a cat on a leash in the middle of Waterloo Station. I wish, yeah, it was young. I wish I had gotten my camera out quick enough and just, or stood there until I got my camera out and taken video because Waterloo Station is very, very noisy and very busy and bustly. And uh, for that cat to be on a leash, it was just, it's something that you're not gonna see ever again. So I thought you all would uh, enjoy that story. We should have stayed that and Buckingham Palace is right here in front of us. So this will be the finish. That's how much time they have. So we are approaching the Queen's Gallery and we have 10 minutes until it opens. Uh, but there's also a shop in here, which I can't wait to see. And the weather's really, really nice. And the purple If you have tickets, if you want to stand behind the gentleman and the lady, if you require the ticket to my colleague. If you have tickets, absolutely behind my colleague. If you have one you need to get to my colleague. Absolutely brilliant. <laughs> And you go through security up here. You can see where you, they check your bags and stuff like that right through here. It looks like airport type security too because it looks like there's bins underneath the table up there. So like they, you might have to take your belt off and stuff. That's what it looks like. So back to the bottom if we want to use the restroom. Should I go now? I'm thinking I should go now.
we've left the Queen's Gallery and Gift Shop and now we're walking over to the Tube Station because we have to go to, uh, we're going to uh, Kensington Palace. There's a uh, Marks and Spencer here and uh, they even sell the clothes so that's a big one. Oh, it says no photography. I wonder why you can't take pictures. So all of that side road that we were just on, it said no photography, so I put my camera away. But now this is Kensington, and I know I took pictures in here last time. So um, I will not be filming again, just because if you're interested in seeing that, then you can look at last year's. What do you think, Kevin? Yeah, I don't, I don't think it's going to be any different than than it was last year. If it is, if they're doing, if I'm allowed um, to like film, I think they have some of Diana's dresses on exhibit. I'm not sure. If they do, if I'm allowed to film it, then I'll film those. Because I know they, they did... Uh, they were going to have an exhibition of her dresses. I'll film this part again just because it's so pretty. <laughs> but if you watched the video from last year, you'll have seen this anyway. need a break after going up all those stairs. Yeah. Don't you? I'm breathing. Oh, they have. These weren't here last year. They have, uh, they've like strapped the columns. I wonder how they even knew there was a problem going on. So much of this I do not remember. I would have to watch, rewatch our own videos.
I see what you mean. Looks like a sleeping baby dress. Okay. He said one thing and pointed to another one. We want to 
I'll see the other shop to do. No, I know we saw this last year. I remember it. Yeah, 
So last time in this room, it looks very different. There was something on the ceiling here, and this bench was round, and um, it looked completely different. It's the room with Diana's pictures in it. And some of the bench is still here, but then they took the thing out of the ceiling. So it'll be interesting when uh, we get home to look back at that video. Don't let me get in your way. You want one from way back here? They smell wonderful. Did you see the duck? Oh, yeah. So this is a good view of Kensington. I don't think you want to do it a third of that place. No, 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 I don't. No. Is that whole side for four? Yeah, it was like, we walked up. One side went to one set of just walls, and then the other side went to the other side, and it came down, wasn't it? Maybe I'm thinking about Hampton Court, where it's like the I know. children and the... You know, I know, I plan to... Um, yeah, maybe I plan to look when we get home yeah. at the video. I think this is the gate entrance, this is the bench, it's my We don't know uh, what these flowers are, so if you know, you can tell us. But they look like crepe paper. They do. They're, They're really very good. thin. Can you walk nearer to them? Yeah. Ultimately, we need to be in that room. Okay. Yeah. Remember the gardens we went to last time, the, the Italian gardens or whatever? Mm -hmm. Basically, that corner. All Don't you want to see? The dining room. I would rather see something different. I would like to see that. That's fine. Yeah. Let's, let's do something a little different. Are we 
did last time. This part. It is. Why don't we go? Let's see if we go around um, that way, and towards the end we'll cut off that direction, and we'll hit a big path and go up that <laughs> Let's not scare the pigeons. <laughs> I'm just kind of standing there waiting. She did. Yeah, she's having a She did. Those are very pretty. Well, what those are. Oh, my goodness. We don't have any uh, that look like this. Yeah, there's a couple of them. There. Hello, Mr. Duck. I don't have any food for you, unfortunately. All these are that color. Mm -hmm. No, I mean over here. No, we don't have any. Ah. That one has some green on it. <clears throat> See the green feather back here? Maybe they're picking for bugs. So we walked from Kensington Palace up to, this is um, the Royal Albert Hall there in the distance. And last year we walked in front of it. And yeah, we didn't walk up across the street, I don't think, to it. So there's the back of it. That's Foxglove. I love the purple. Do you want to cross again or? Oh, let's look at this map back there. Okay. Okay. Yeah, I don't know. This looks like a big bush and these flowers on it look blue. From afar they look purple and then the closer you get they actually look they look blue. Very blue purple. They're pretty. They're very pretty. They look like they were hanging too, but they're not. They're just, it's just a bush. Mm -hmm. Are you sure we didn't need to go in up there? Can we go in right here? Yeah. I think it's what this four built park here and walk in. Look at that on that tree. It looks like a rose is growing through the tree. Look at these roses right here. I thought he was playing with the fountain. Look how tall these roses are. They're taller than me. Literally taller than me. Not seeing the top of that. These are areas for quiet enjoyment. <laughs> Is that what it says? Yeah. yeah. There's no quiet enjoyment with children. Lots and lots of children. That's okay. The flowers are gorgeous. I mean, there's one. And you can't see the white. They're see all the peony? No, those are peony. Oh, are they? Mm hmm. They got that one white kind of above, right through it all around. I thought that was cool. Look at those. Look at those firefighters. 
uh, those are the ones they sell in the pots that we bought in a pot. And I told you, we see them at Lowe's and they're a hanging basket, yes. They have the little balls? Yes, they had them. They had them on the end oh. of those. Do you see that statue over there? There's paddle boats over there. Yeah. Those paddle boats all up in their row boats, that's it. See them? Mm -hmm. I'm surprised since this is for Princess that's Diana. Quiet yeah, that they're actually letting people um, in it. You, you probably could, well. <laughs> Just like Alexa place, once you got one person there. Let me grab it out That thing is, you can't get a good picture. No, you can't get a good picture because there's people everywhere. And it's starting to sprinkle a little bit. Where, where are we going to go? Over there? Those paddle boats are huge. They are big. So yeah. They put kids in the front. Now they got regular sizes too. Oh, Kevin, I love the bridge. You need to take a picture of the bridge. I don't think you're going to get one without the paddle back though. <laughs> Do you want to walk down under here? So last year we saw black and white ducks. This year we see some black and white birds. And I have, and they're big. I mean, that is a big bird. Yes, it has blue, blue on its tail. So the bridge that we saw just a while ago from down below, we're now walking across it. It's it's called a Serpentine Bridge. They have food they get them. See them? Oh yeah. Walk over here, Kevin. Well, they were trying to pass us. I was hate for people to be. I know. I hate for people to be behind us, though. Oh, and one at the bottom. Good actually.
Oh, I don't have anything. I'm sorry. Oh, look, he's scared. That's so sweet. Look. He's scared. Oh, that was so sweet. They're sweet, aren't they? I don't know if you can see, there's horses going through the park right there. Right there. I didn't notice from back there, but these uh, statues are wearing, the, the faces have masks. And then here's the fountains, and those are beautiful. Look at this giant uh, horse head monument. So now we're at Marble, Marble Arch Station. So this will be Marble Arch right here on your left. Got beeped at. You haven't really lived until you've gotten beeped at. That's right. Right now we are on Oxford. We were here last year as well, and we're he heading to uh, Selfridges because we did not go in here last year. We went in. Was the toy store on this street? Uh, no, this region. What did we go in on this street? Anything? Oh, they were winning. Oh, okay. So we there's a huge Primark, giant Primark, Holland and Barrett. But I mean, look at this Primark. Primark for days. Well, I thought we were on the street last year, but since we weren't. That Primark takes up the whole block. Literally, the whole block. Okay, this is Selfridges. Kevin said. Yeah, Kevin said, this is Selfridges. I'll make sure that I get a uh, picture up here because it looks like there's some kind of um, monument over the door. There's something over the door. I want to get a, it's, is that the main? Yeah, I want to get a picture of that thing over the door. probably the busiest area that we've been in today because for the most part it's been quiet do you want to come over here and take it well I got under a bush okay here we go right here Kevin okay here we go 
So this is all uh, colognes. Do you want to find the? Have you clear where you want to go? Well, I want to go to the food hall. It's this way. If we want to see toys first, do you want to go to the toys first before we go? Um, I bet there's a map towards these escalators. Yeah, right here. Number four. Number four. So let's go. Those are uh, everything you want on four. Okay, can we go to number four then? Yeah, go on. So this whole um, floor that you walk in on is all cosmetics and it looks like there's a cafe right down there I'll try to show you as we're going up I don't know how much that they're gonna let me film if they see me filming they might ask me to stop since we haven't been in here before I don't know There's the cafe over here. They're getting afternoon tea. They're having afternoon tea over there. From a shop of whiskey. And then up here. Very expensive clothes. So we're going up to we're going up to number four because we want to see what kind of kid stuff they have. So these are women's clothes, designer galleries, shoe galleries, personal shopping. We're going to keep on going. So I guess this is uh, the teenager clothes. That's what it looks like in shopping up here is teenager clothes. They have Mike here, which Ashley would like. This is short. Huh? Short. Oh, okay. So is this the one right here? Okay, because they have books. I didn't realize they had books. Ooh, yeah, they have toys. You want me to look at books? Oh, okay. It's 1,750 pounds for that book. I said that, yeah. Okay, we don't want any WrestleMania. Oh my goodness, I've never seen that before. Ah, uh, yeah.
their toys don't seem to be laid out as nice nicely as um, parents. They have the little, uh, they have the minifigure sets. Oh, yeah. Oh, they have Darth Vader. How much is it? So they have uh, this Princess Peppa's Palace here. They have a lot more Peppa Pig stuff here than they do at home. Look, you can just buy, you can just buy the kitchen. I like the dress up pack. And then they have this one. Yeah, see, we don't have, we don't have all of these. Here's a Princess Peppa's tea party. Lots of Paw Patrol. Oop. Well, I went to the bathroom and they had a real toilet paper in here not the sheets they had the real stuff I think it's funny that they had the real stuff in here and at the Queen's Gallery but they did not have the real stuff at Kensington I just find that interesting also something that they had that I had not seen before was when I um, went to when I washed my hands and I went to dry my hands the dryer was actually up under the mirror. If I had not seen someone else drying their hands in there, I would not have known where the, where the hand dryer was because it was literally tucked up under the mirror where I don't know how you're supposed to even know that it's there. So I just thought that was interesting. So we bought Gavin a present and I bought a, um, another Mr. Men book that I did not have, believe it or not. You have a lot of denim. Man, this is the men. Yeah, this is all the men's section. Um, but Gavin will like his gift. Uh, by the time you see this, he'll have gotten it. So I'll tell you, we bought him a um, Darth Vader figure because he's, for some reason, he's gotten it into his head. He loves Darth Vader, and so we looked in Walmart and places around where we live and. Because Darth Vader, is Darth Vader not in the last movie? Is that why we can't find one? Yeah, we haven't been able to find one just because he's really not in the last movie, I guess. So, we bought him one while we could get it. And we probably paid $5 more than what we normally would have, but that's okay. I'm glad that we were able to get one for him. I'm glad Kevin thought about it because I, I wouldn't have even thought about it. So... So now we're going, I want to go to the food, of course. I want to see if they have any candy bars or anything like that for us to try. I never knew there was so much makeup. Did you know there were, did you know? I had no idea there was so much cologne. There's the Clinique. Okay, right here. This is Godiva right here. Yeah, I want to see stuff like this. New British Fudge Selection. It says, ooh la la. I smell peanut butter right now. Oh my goodness, you would not believe all this food. Tons of, of uh, chocolates. It's amazing. 